He's a black man. Right. Read what you got. Revelation 18, verse 4. And I heard another voice from heaven saying, Come out of her, my people. The Bible said, we, the Negroes and Hispanics, the Bible said to come out of the philosophy of America. Because guess what? This is when this corner is pushing. What they're pushing? Christianity. That's another philosophy. They're pushing this. That's another philosophy. Guess what? The apostles never teach this. The apostles in the Bible never teach that Christ is a white man. You know why? Because Christ is not a white man. The Bible says Christ is a dark man like me and you. But guess what? The circle white men don't want you to believe that. That's why in slavery, they didn't allow us to read and write. Why? Because they want us to believe this. They was busy in printing this in our mind. And a lot of us got this picture in our house. If this man know Christ is a black man, he will never carry that sign. You know why? Because he don't want to worship a black Christ. Give me the color of Christ for him. Give me the color of Christ. No, this is Christ. This is what you believe in. This is not Christ. The Bible don't describe Christ like this. And I'm gonna prove it. This is Sija Bosher. This is a real man. This is not the cross in the Bible that he's pushing. And I know for a fact, he only here because he wants you to believe this garbage, this trash. Right. Read. Revelation 1, verse 14. Read. His head and his hands were white like wool. The Bible said Christ got woolly hair. Who got woolly hair in the earth today? The so-called Negro. That's right. You don't know who got woolly hair. Not the so-called white man. Look at him, he don't have no woolly hair. <laughs> we got the woolly hair. Read. His head and his hands were white like wool. As white as he yeah, his hair in his hair, his beard in his hair were white like wool. Yeah, get this one. What does that mean? He was a so-called Negro. Read. And his eyes was a flame of fire. Why his eyes was a flame of fire? Because Christ drank a lot of wine. Because if you know the history, Christ's first miracle, he didn't want to wine. Read. Verse 15. And his feet like a divine brand. Hold, hold, hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Read that again for him. And his feet like a divine brand. What color is grass, brother? What color is grass? What color is grass? Is he, is that look like one to you? No. 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 Christ is a so-called Negro. Right. And if he know that, he will never worship him. He will never worship Christ. Because Christ is not for him. Christ only came to die for the so-called Negroes and Spanish. And I can prove that in the Bible. Read. And his feet like a divine grass as if they burn in a furnace. As if they burn in a furnace. Anything you throw in a furnace that's burned, what color it become, brother? It become brown. Anything you burn, if you throw a hill of rice and fire, what color become? Black. Black. Christ was a very dark man. That's what the Bible says. Read it again. Right. And his feet like a divine grass as if they burn in a furnace. As if they burn in a furnace. This is the Old New Testament, right? Let's go to the Old Testament. Because the prophet Daniel also saw Christ. Read. Daniel chapter 10 verse 5. Then I lifted up mine eyes and looked and behold a certain man so Daniel, the prophet Daniel said in a vision, he said he looked, he saw a man clothed in linen, in clothing, long clothes, three, whose voice was going to find gold of you fans. His lion, he got a golden belt, read. Verse six, his body also was like the bell. His and body also like the bell. When he look at his clothes, what is the bell? Bell is green. He said the garment this man wear, he got a green garment, long to his foot, read. And his face as the appearance of lightning. Read. And the eyes as the to fire. The eyes as a level of fire. Because if you remember, we just read in the book of Revelation, his eyes as a level of fire. Why? Because he drank wine. Daniel and John saw the same man. Read. And his arms and his feet like in color to polished brass. His arm. Daniel, look at this man's arm. He look at his feet. Like to call him to punish Christ. What color is Christ again? Brown. So Christ 
is a brown man. And let me get this straight. Let me put this straight. There is no such a thing as a black man and a white man. You know why? Because we're not black. We're different shade of brown. Right. The so right. white man is not white. They are red. They are different shade of red. There is no such a thing. Because if you look at the so-called white man, he's not the color of this white shirt he's blown away. They want you to believe they're white, they're pure. That's what they call themselves white men. But the Bible said they are red. That's what the Bible said. And their father is Esau. And I can prove it in the Bible. Give me Genesis 25. Because you know something? The so-called white men think they're going to get away from what they did in slavery. You will not get away. We will you not get away? Right. Cross is coming back to check that ass. You ain't gonna get away. <laughs> You're not gonna get away. It's gonna be a race war. You want us to forget. You want us to forget. That's why you passing your little flyers. That's why you got your sign. Jesus changed my life. We ain't gonna forget. We ain't gonna forget. We, our job as an Israelite is to come here every Saturday with my use of our Negroes. What this soccer white man did. And for you to repent and get yourself right. So Christ can come back. Read. Genesis 25, verse 23. And the Lord said unto her, Two nations are in thy womb. So, the Bible, this is, uh, you got Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. This is Isaac. Isaac is the father of Jacob. So, Isaac, wife cannot have no kids. So now, the, the, uh, the brother went to Mosai. He has no son why can have kids, so now his wife got pregnant. So now his wife is pregnant, but the babies start fighting inside her. Now she went to Mosa, she said, why, if this is a blessing, why am I like it? Why these kids is fighting inside me? This is what God responds, we did again. And the Lord turned to her, two nations are in thy womb. So God said to this woman, to this black woman, you got two different nations inside of you. So what does that mean? They're going to be twins, but they're not going to look alike. They're not going to look alike. Read. And two manner of people so shall So God be. said, two manner of people, two manner means two different type of people. Read. Shall be separated from thy bowels. So God is telling this woman, these two people are going to be separated. That's why you see today when they're talking about black and white gotta come together. That's garbage. Never from the beginning, God separate them from each other. Right. All this interracial marriage is right. garbage. Right. That's not in the Bible. That's right. Read. And the one people shall be stronger than the other people. So God is telling this woman, out of these two brothers, one is gonna be stronger than the other one. Now we're gonna find out later on who's the strongest one. Read. And the elder shall serve the younger. The elder shall serve the younger. What does that mean? The, the younger boy is going to serve the elder boy. He's going to serve the elder boy. Read. Verse 24. Read that again. Read that again. The and, the, elder. and the elder shall serve the younger. The elder, I mean, is going to serve the, the younger. Because if you continue to read, the so-called white man was the elder brother. The scripture said he's going to serve the younger. What does that mean? The so-called white man is going to serve you so-called Negroes. That's what that means. And we're going to prove it. Read. And when her days to be delivered were fulfilled, when they therefore it took it birth, read, behold, there were twins in her womb. Behold, there were two boys, twins. Read. Verse 25. And the first came out red. The first son came out red. That's why you see in the in the south, what they call so they call the so-called so so white men. Red legs. That's what they call them. They were red. Now, read. And the first came out red. Called 
Joaquin Sons Hill. He's here to call his son Hill. That, like, like I said, that don't give the definition of his brother. Because his brother was the same color as his mother and the father. But this, this first boy come out red, that's why they give his color. Right. So who is the red man? He's talking about, he's talking about the so-called white man today. The Jacob is the so-called Negro today in the Spanish. Right. We are the sons of Jacob. We make the 12 job of Israel. Right. That's according to the Bible. Now give me a uh, uh, second answer. Give me a second answer about uh, the other issues or nothing. Because this dude right here is teaching, he's preaching, talking about God love everybody. No, God do not love everybody. And I'm going to prove that. I don't know what you wicked pastor been telling you. God do not love everybody. Right. Jesus don't die for everybody. Right. That's what the Bible said. That's what we're going to teach. Jesus don't love everybody. Right. Jesus only died for the nation of Israel. Right. Hold right. that. Give me the one in, uh, uh, in, in, in uh, Matthew. And let's prove what Jesus said with his own mouth. You've been confused. You've been lied to. You so-called Negroes in Spanish. You've been lied to. It's about time we break up that line. Right. Now today is the day of truth. Right. Read. Matthew chapter 15, verse 24. Read. But he answered and said, I am not sent but unto the Lord sheep of the house of Israel. What is Jesus sent? But I am not sent but unto the Lord sheep of the house of Israel. This is what Jesus said with his own mouth. The black Messiah. He said, I only died for the nation of Israel. I only came to deliver the nation of Israel. Right. right. Hold that. Give me Matthew 121. Jesus only died for the 12 tribes in this son. Jesus don't die for everybody. I don't know what Bible you've been reading. I don't know what you wicked pastor is telling you. Read. And she shall bring forth a son. She shall bring forth a son. Read. And thou shalt call his name Jesus. Thou shalt call his name Jesus. The black Messiah. Read. For he shall save his people. He shall save who? His people. No, he's going to save the Chinese. He shall save his people from their sins. Read. He shall save his people. Who is God's people? Give me that scripture. Give me a... Uh, go over there. Go, go to uh, the first one I asked you. Read that. Second Andrew chapter 6, verse 56. Read. And as for the other people, as for the other people, which also come of Adam, because everybody coming out of Adam. Now, the prophet Ezra is going to break something down to you. Because a lot of you thinking, God love everybody, Jesus died for everybody. The prophet Ezra is going to show you something in the Holy Bible, which a lot of you do not read. Read. As for the other people which also come of Adam. As for the other people, because everybody comes from Adam. Read. Thou hast said that they are nothing. You know something? Start, 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 start from the verse of Verse 54. And after these, Adam also, who now made us thought of all thy creatures. Read. Of him come we all. Of him, of Adam, came we all. Everybody come from Adam. Read. And the, and the people who also that has chosen. The people who have chosen. Because God make everybody. But guess what? God chose a certain people for himself. God do not chose the whole world. God, I'm going to say it again. God did not chose the whole world. Right. He chose a certain people. Is he created everybody? Yes. But he only chose one people. Read. Right. As for the other people which also come of Adam, all this have I spoken before you, Lord, because thou made the world for our sake. God said he made the world for our sake. The world made for these people. The world wasn't made for everybody. Everybody is supposed to serve these people in this side. That's what God said. When we want to prove it further, read. Verse 56. As for the other people which also come of Adam, thou hast said that they are not. God said people out of the outside of the church church they are nothing right that's the word of god read it again for you right. for you so-called christians now, as for the other people which also come of adam read thou hast said that they are nothing god said they are nothing they are the nation outside of israel they are nothing, nothing. Right. the so-called white man god says he's nothing right the chinese man god says